30-minute total body for us today. So we're going to start uh, with a single arm clean to reverse lunge with a shoulder press. So with a single dumbbell, I'm going to squat. The weight's going to come between my feet. Um, I'm going to press my feet back into a squat. I clean up against my body, kick that same foot back in a reverse lunge while I press overhead. And then when I'm in that squat position, I'm going to switch arms. Okay, so alternating sides. Just remember to kick that same foot back that you have that weight in hand so that you're alternating back and forth. Second exercise is going to be uh, plank pull-throughs. So you'll grab a heavier dumbbell on the mat, will be in high plank position, and you're going to pull that dumbbell across your body from one side to the other. <clears throat> Excuse me. Uh, then while we're on the mat, we'll be on all fours, loop band around our knees. We're going to donkey kick, press that foot up to the ceiling. If you don't have a loop band, a weight behind your knee uh, will do as well. Then we'll be low side plank with a leg raise. Fifth exercise will be double dumbbells in hand. We'll be back standing um, into a side lunge, pressing our seat back. Those dumbbells will come down uh, to our feet or at least lower uh, to your, press to your knee and then back upright. Okay, so you control the intensity there, what feels right to you to get a challenge uh, without you know, having, to, having to stop. So you'll keep moving there and then we'll end uh, with, an, with um, tricep kickbacks. Okay, so some, some focus here on chest and triceps, but uh, really covering the total body. So I'll get our music started and our timer. Grab that single weight for the uh, single arm clean to reverse lunge. Go. Sorry, I've got to retrain myself a little bit. Go. You can see I've got a clock timer now that you're able to see as well. But I found the sound to be really loud. So I'm going to try this recording without a beep. Since you can see the clock too. Great. Remember to be switching off sides here. Go, round three. Break. Round four. Go. Break. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Tickle this morning. Two more. Go. Break. Last one. Go. Break. All right, set that weight aside. 10 second transition, our first cardio is going to be a high knee. 
One minute there, one minute of speed skaters. Let's go. We had some neighborhood excitement last night. Cop car pulled up in front of our house. I was like, <laughs> but somebody, somebody on the street must be away on vacation, but the alarm was going off. So they were here to investigate, but nothing came of it, thankfully. 10 seconds here. Keep them up, come on. Skaters, go. <clears throat> keep it up, keep those moves, keep moving quick. All right, you're going to take a medium to heavy weight with you to the mat for plank pull throughs. And then you're also going to need a loop band or a dumbbell for those donkey kicks. All right, ready, steady, plank, pull throughs, go. So it's coming across your body, alternating sides, left to right, right to left. Break. Three. Go. I don't know about y'all, but that three minute plank from the other day, I think is still sticking with me. Woo. Break. I'm pretty sure I broke right through that. Or went right through it. Here we go again. Go. Break. Good work. We're halfway through these. Here we go. Plank. Go. Break. All right, think about two more, two more rounds. Think about holding your plank. Go. Holding your plank steady and not rocking from side to side. Break. Coming up on it, last one. Go.
break on your backs, on your backs for butterflies and bicycles. Press those knees apart, feet together. Okay. We have kind of a pretty morning here. Low humidity, a little bit of a breeze. I'm sure it'll pick back up. It is July after all, but it was nice while it lasted. seconds here, then we're going to switch to bicycles. All right, one minute left. We're going to switch to bicycles. You can always modify these by just pumping your legs. As you get stronger, you're going to add in that upper body twist, pressing your elbow into your knee. Finish these up about five seconds. Then if you've got a loop band, you'll get those around your knees. Break. Get those loop bands around your knees or come over to tabletop all fours and get one weight behind your knee. And go. Pressing one foot up to the ceiling. I've got that loop band hooked under my left knee while I'm pressing up with my right foot. Break. All right, you'll switch sides. And go. Let's come up and pulse at the top now. So you're going to press that foot up in the air. Just pulse at the top. Squeezing those glutes. Breathing deep. Break. We'll switch sides. We'll pulse with the other leg now. Here we go. Go. Pulse. Break. All right, we've got one more each side now. Let's go back to a full extension. So knee to chest and then press that foot up into the air. Ready, go. When you bring that knee to chest, get it really core squeeze. Great. All right, last one. Here we go. All right, knee to chest. 
Then press that foot up, go. All right, back on your seat. Take that loop band off. You're going to press those feet into the air for toe tap. I'm going to have a carrier coming up. Go. It felt like a big victory to figure out how to work this Tabata timer and program it to allow me to keep the same kind of cycle as I had. It didn't take it didn't take long, but you know that initially it's like bah! I'm reading the direction over and over, going, but I did that and it's not working. But got it to work. Fifteen seconds. Shout out to Sweet Jen Jammer who suggested this to bought a timer months ago and I drug my feet on it. Heel tap. Go ahead and bend those knees. You're going to alternate the heel to the ground. But with the in person pop up last weekend, it became even more like it realized how much more important it was. So. Thought we'll get a double use out of it here. I'm sure you all enjoy seeing where we are. And if I miss a miss a count, then you you can hold me to that. Twenty seconds, keep tapping those heels. Great. All right, we're in low side plank. Low side plank with a leg, optional leg raise. And lift. Control that motion. Don't let your foot just drop down. Take your time. Break. Switch sides. Here we go. We're coming back up in two, one, up. Break, flip. Here we go, coming up in three. Go. Halfway there. Go. I usually get really nice texts on side plank days. Tracy, thank you. I've been meaning to put more side planks in my life. Break. One more each side. Hey. At least, you know, I'm sweating it out with you. You can see these are, these are a challenge for me, too. Go. And if you're not to the leg raise yet, that's okay. Hold that plank.
Break. Last one. And up. Break. Ah, good work. All right, we're on our backs. We've got a minute of flutter kicks and a minute of penguins. Here we go, go. Whew. Breathe deep. Halfway there. Let's hip work with those side planks. Take a break, rejoin if you need it. Keep going. Just don't quit. Ten seconds. Here we go. Those Ooh, penguins. Skin your heels side to side. If it feels good to open up your hips there, you can penguin in this position too with butterfly knees. Thirty seconds. Okay, I finished Burnout, the book by the Nagalski sisters, Emily and Amelia. Um, very good, very dense, rich, um, thought-provoking. I'd like to go onto the website and pull up the, you know, some of the sum summaries and kind of study guide things, because it was just a lot of information. We're going to be back on our feet. Back on our feet, you're going to grab your dumbbells, we're on to side lunges. Here we go. Pick a side, any side. Sorry, I got behind. Press that seat back and back upright. Break. We'll come to the other side now. Oops, sorry. Sorry for the noise. And go. I downloaded um, audiobook, The Vanishing Half, because I have this long drive coming up this weekend. Break. So if you've read that one, let me know what you think. And then I just started um, Atomic Habits, go, by James or Jim Clear. Um, really liking that one. And it's a short one. On audio, it's only five hours. So, But I love the study of habits and, you know, how all those little things add up. So break. So I feel like I could recognize or I could recommend this one already and I'm only maybe twenty percent in. Here we go. Go. Drive that seat back, drive through that heel, press yourself upright. Break. Roll those shoulders back. Go. Okay, 
Okay, our last cardio set after this. Break. All right, one more of these side lunges. And then our last cardio set is going to be a little bit of a dance move, a cha-cha dance move. Go. You're going to cross one foot out front, cha-cha-cha, and then the other one. Break. All right, set those weights aside, the cardio moves. Cardio move, you've got five seconds, but I'm going to go right foot out front, cha-cha-cha, left foot, cha-cha-cha. Okay, join me. It's a little bit of locomotion, I think. Just keep them going fast. Good job, 20 seconds. I'm slowing down. <laughs> I don't mean to, my coordination slows. And my energy, I guess. Woo! Take them out, we'll end with the last minute of double jumping jacks. So that's in hop, out hop. Ooh, both of those are tough on the calves. He got it. Oops. Ooh, maybe I should. I can tell my floor isn't holding up for this one. Almost there, 25. Last exercise is tricep kickbacks. Whew, break. Shake them out, grab those tricep kickback weights. Double dumbbells. We're gonna hinge forward. You're gonna activate your glutes. Go, those elbows are coming up to the side, locking in place. And you're pressing those dumbbells from your chest all the way, extending them to your back. Good work. Break. Round two coming up. Go, hinge forward. This glute work is just as important as our donkey kicks. Holding stable. Break. Good job. I'm at my step goal. My watch buzz to tell me. Here we go. Go. Break. Halfway. Go. Break. Two more. Whew. 
Here we go. Go. Our youngest made his way to our bed last night about two and did, it, did so in a way that was loud enough to jolt me awake as well, but I got back to sleep, thankfully. Break. But he, he always wants to sleep in our bed. And he's the youngest, so most of the time I don't really care. Go. But we're having AC unit issues and our room is pretty warm already. I mean, it's, it's bearable, but it's, the air is not working great. Um, so last night I'm like, nobody. Sleep in your own bed, but two o'clock break. That was enough of that apparently. So he made his way to us. All right, good work. Fetch those fingertips overhead. Oh, good reach. Hook there. Hook your thumbs. Maybe lean toward one side. Feel that stretch all the way down your oblique. Ooh. Other side. As you do that, press your hands behind your head. Don't let yourself think we kind of want to collapse this way, right? But press that hand back. Good. Open up and do a goal post. Pressing your shoulders behind you. Open left and right. Maybe some easy neck loosening left, right, or no, no, no. Yes, yes, yes. Link your fingers behind your back. Lift. And step your feet. Wide stance. Hinge forward to the center with soft knees. You can pedal your knees straight and left, straight and right. Getting a hamstring stretch in here. Walk your fingertips over to your left foot. Hinge forward. Draw your belly to your quad. Think about pressing that spine in. And then walk over to your right. Same thing here. Belly to belly to quad. Hang in the center. And then let's hit those inner thighs with a side lunge. And then over to your other side. Good work. Good, hit those calves before we finish up. Pedal right, pedal left. Good work. Have a great day, thanks for joining.